new achievement in light deprivation is the breathable walls. Originally, when we light dep a greenhouse, we're not able to move air through the greenhouse. We can only use the circulation fans, and that doesn't give us the fresh air we're looking for. Because again, when we cover up the greenhouse in a, in a tent or a bubble, it's unnatural. And so in order to move the air, especially for people that are in these humid zones and tropical regions, You've got to move all the air all the time. When the blackout system is closed, louvers in the greenhouse with the fans and intakes usually let light in and we couldn't actually use the fans and intakes during the light depth period. So now we have something called the breathable wall and what it does is it actually just traps the light letting the air flow. And so when we keep the air moving without the passage of light, we can actually use our big 36 inch exhaust fans and 42 inch intake shutters on the greenhouse that we would normally try to use uh, during a day or a cold zone, uh, but while it's blacked out. So I have a lot of people that do retrofits to existing greenhouses. I have a lot of people that build their own little structures out of PVC or maybe even wood. And everybody wants the ability to move the air without the passage of light. Now anybody can do this with any type of fan uh, for most sizes and move a little bit of air or a lot of air while their blackout system is closed. And so the other thing is, is indoor growers love them too because actually indoor growers have the same uh, need. And when they have multiple flowering rooms, veg rooms or cloning, and all these things, light cycles can be at different periods and they also need to move air without the passage of light. And so normally you'd see the ducting going back and forth or 90 degree angles and baffles created to move this air without the light. Well, now there's a simple fixture that can be put up and let the air move passively or be fixed over a fan and an intake to actually help move this air across, which actually helps the quality uh, of the product. Now with breathable walls and breathable fabrics in your greenhouse, people in other zones that are in tropical, more humid zones have a better chance of doing some of the things that other people are doing in these drier areas. So the things that we thought we couldn't do, uh, now we probably can say we can.